Hello everyone, welcome back to the new video in frontend development. In this video, we learn about the bootstrap. So what is bootstrap? Bootstrap is a pre-written CSS or JavaScript framework. Uh, this is a bootstrap website. Uh, for bootstrap, you can go to the getbootstrap.com and see the bootstrap website. To start bootstrap, at first you download the bootstrap folder. Folder. For this, you can click this link and you can download the zip file. After clicking this link, you can get this kind of file which name was bootstrap. Let's zoom it. Bootstrap 7, uh, 3.37. This is the version. Unzip this file. After unzip, we can get this three file. Just copy this and paste outside the folder and delete this, delete this to folder. Okay. After the after the delete, you can go to the CSS folder. You can see here the many files are here, but for now, we only use this two file bootstrap.css and bootstrap min.css. Rest of the file you can delete or you leave it as it here. Okay. After this CSS part, you can see here the fonts fonts folder. Here some fonts and file here, but now we use go only Google fonts. After fonts, here we see the JS or JavaScript folder. In this folder, you can see the bootstrap.javascript JS file or bootstrap.min.js file and npm.js file. You can see. After that, now we see the website, main website for this. Again, I go to the get bootstrap.com and click to get started okay just to zoom it after get started you can see here the many file bootstrap source snas sas sorry download the get bootstrap file Pre you can also download the previous one doesn't matter actually this is the previous one okay you can see here our the bootstrap cdn and many things and here our basic bootstrap template this is to run bootstrap we can use some tricks or we can use some method for this i go to my browser and I already create an index.html file. Inside the index.html file, now I link my CSS or the CSS which is situated in bootstrap folder. For this, I just delete this href folder and just type CSS. Inside CSS, I select bootstrap.min.css and save it now just delete it okay you can also see you can also select or we have to select the javascript part for this we have to enter a script tag at the end of the body here or at at the end of the body but we not do this process <coughs> we choose some other process for this I go to this extension manager in bracket and open it it takes some time just bear with me <coughs> okay yes it's loaded after you I click install 
I installed it previously. You can simply install ACB new bootstrap template. Make sure you only install the create a new HTML with a basic bootstrap temple template. This add-on. Okay. After the install this add-on, you can close it. Go to this file section. Click here. After clicking the file section, file part, click the new bootstrap file. You can get a complete new bootstrap file or here our CSS section and here our script tag. Okay. This is the hacks we can use here and we can also verify it is it working or not for this i type simple h1 tab inside h1 tag i type lorem 5 and save it and i save it as a my bootstrap my boot dot html and open it okay here our file <coughs> okay this code is running in this way we can create our bootstrap file now we see the bootstrap website for this I go again go to the getbootstrap.com and here you can see some example for example I click the expo and you can go to the expo here you can see the many bootstrap design website which is designed on bootstrap just click one of them this website is designed in bootstrap it is nice okay I go to the again another bootstrap design and click it it's just loading yes this is also a website which is loaded in bootstrap pretty good website this is this is pretty good okay after that we can see how bootstrap work and or why we use bootstrap for this i click this css section inside css i create the button here you can see you can design this kind of button directly choose this or copy this code you for bootstrap you can't design you are not to design this button tag in inside button tag you have to create a class for bootstrap you only copy this code and you can design this button in this way you can design many things like tables also you can design many of these tables like you can design this kind of tables also for this you have to copy this code and paste it in your ID. In this way bootstrap help to design our CSS more fast more prominent. In bootstrap we also design the simple form or basic form. Here our email address field we can type anything here our password field which is also encrypted here we can select any of our file and the checkbox is also work and the submit button for this you just simply copy this code and run it your file is running this is the introduction video of bootstrap in this video that's all for bootstrap upcoming video we see how the buttons the form the table are works in bootstrap thank you for watching this video 
प्लीज़ लाइक शेयर एंड सब्सक्राइब प्लीज़